<laughs> the most disgusting thing I think I saw was Jake Curran's death. I was on set that day watching the watching the playback. That was horrible to watch his close up. Uh, on that was 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 the worst I think. The blood in my eyes, and uh, the, uh, I had to move my head, and there was this great chunky thing kept cracking me in the back of the head. The best part of Bulgaria is there's right next to the, the main city, Sofia, the capital, there's this mountain called Vitosha, and it has this, you know, national forest. And the woods are just spectacular, huge haunting trees. There's also this river of boulders. Literally, it's a river made out of boulders. And underneath the water, you can hear the water going. That's where I shot the uh, fire sequence. <laughs> I'm really, really proud of the fire sequence, uh, setting Gil Coran on fire. It's really him there. I was approached and said, do you want to go in flames? And I, I hand on heart, I was totally relaxed about it. I said, yeah, why not? Let's go for it. Watch closely. So help me God, it is me. Action! There is another take when a wonderful stuntman comes in and does the full body stuff, but up to that point, it's all me, baby. Everybody! Everybody! Okay! Oh. Oh. The other one was launching this tow truck, you know, into a tree. We had to pick the right tree so we wouldn't knock the tree over. Uh, and we had to have enough of a straightaway, and then it was a matter of building the ramp. You know, we got the shot off, and the stunt driver hit that tree just right, and, and the, the back wheels of the truck came right over the camera that was in the crash camera. So we got pretty lucky there as well. And, uh, and believe it or not, there was just like a little nick. And that's it. I was like, you know, I'm worried about the tree. It didn't harm the tree at all. The tree was perfectly fine, and we bashed in the whole front of this, you know, Ford pickup. You know, I had to crash the tow truck, and I had to explode the tow truck. And I had to do it all in one night. Um, and then I had to get the Dawn shot. The uh, line producer has this moped, right? And so I, I took over the moped for the shoot. So I'd go around and, you know, I'd have the moped and I'd be able to go check makeup and go down, you know, the camera truck and go to set and all that sort of stuff. Dawn is coming in and everybody is just tired, completely tired. And it's like, you know, one of the last days of shooting. and. Uh, I know I have to get this shot. And nobody's coordinating anything because they're just burned out. Got a bullhorn, hopped on the moped, zoomed down to, to the guys, uh, these two guys and, uh, on one side for the cars, and zoomed around to the other two guys. And, OK, when I call action, you're going to do this, you're going to do this. And I zoom back. And as I'm zooming back towards uh, Video Village, you know, I'm calling, action, <laughs> you know, as I'm on the, on the moped. And everybody starts going because I knew that if I, you know, I wanted to get that shot. I wanted to get it at dawn, and it had to be right. So uh, it was pretty wild and crazy. Yeah.